Hello, it's Bart here, and welcome back to Sonic Superstars. Last time, we beat Casino Zone as Trip, and now we're moving on to the fifth zone as Trip, which is Lagoon City Zone, Act 1. I can guarantee we're not going to find the golden enemy, because the secrets are a lot harder now that we're playing Trip Story, as well as the gameplay. Also, um, I did not expect this loading scene to take forever. Oh great, already spamming the cloud enemy, my least favorite enemy in the game by the way. I'm just kidding, it's actually the purple spike enemy. But this enemy is actually a close second right there. Oh wait, duh, we have water. Oh wait, water doesn't work for these. I forgot. So I guess you're just supposed to jump on them. Like this. Any secrets up here is the real question. And I guess it's just the top path. See? I'm telling you. Super difficult. Okay, hold on one second. Okay, we are back. As for this, I'm not actually too sure. So Lagoon City Zone, actually a pretty fun stage. So I wonder how they changed to it to make it more difficult. So far, it's actually not too bad. It's just a lot of spikes and cloud enemies so far, isn't it? Okay, at least you get more of a warning than the spike enemies. That's for sure. Oh yeah, I completely forgot the snakes even existed. I'm gonna try and try not to die at all. Let's try it. Okay, let's see if I can go an entire video without dying. That's our challenge for today. Ouch, that hurt. Oops, I did not mean to go down that way. That was an accident right there. Anyways, today's challenge for the video is to not die. If I can go an entire video without dying, that'd be pretty cool. And I want to take this waterfall shortcut, okay? Leave me alone. Wait, we haven't hit a checkpoint yet? That's crazy. I thought we had. What if they remove all the checkpoints in this stage? That'd be quite cool, wouldn't it? Oh, there was a checkpoint right there. Now I want to go back so we can get to the waterfall. Just because it's cool to watch uh, the characters swim up waterfalls. There we go. Boom. So we gotta be careful not to waste any of our powers either. Is this something we can push? Destroy maybe? Okay. Nope. You're just a dude. Ooh, nice, but there's water networking to go through. Also, that's how you get that blue ring. I was wondering how we were supposed to get that. Oh no, not this one. Great. It's time to watch me fail once again. This one is just so tricky. So very tricky. I just feel like the bouncing does not give us any extra speed. Watch as I fail. Jump. Alright, I need to jump to this one. There we go. And then we're gonna drop down and watch as I fail to actually grab it. What? Wait, 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 what? We got this solution the whole time. Go up once, drop down, then go up again, and then drop down. That's insane to me. I can't believe we actually did it. That's pretty cool. Anyways, let's continue on. For now, we'll continue on. Nice, we got the checkpoint again, which means more power. Okay, I also gotta remember to utilize the Chaos Emerald powers a little bit more. I like the challenge of not using them, you know? Okay, this is a case where we might need them. I'm surprised there isn't a power based on electricity. I feel like we were going through the elements for a little bit until, you know, we didn't. Ooh, we can become super trip if we want to. That will help us not die. That'd be a good idea. Let's go super trip for a little bit. Plus, we can fly a super trip. Oh, wait. The boss time. I forget. The boss does take away your ability to become super. Unless I reactivate again, but I'm sure we should try and fight this boss as normal, honestly. There we go. Boom. Take that. Okay, what I need to make sure is that I avoid all the enemies. From what I remember, this boss is actually really easy, but I don't know what they changed to make it harder. Did they make it so that this slams down faster? Maybe? 
Oh, nice. We did it before you could even electrify the water. It might be the second phase I remember being hard for this boss. After all, it is a mini boss. Oh. You're gonna be doing this now. I see. I see. Still not gonna be any issue for me. Because I'm in the zone today. Boom. Boom. In oh no. Ah. I got bounced. Oh. Did not mean to do that. Oh, I did not realize. Oh. It's not making me upset. As soon as I said I was in the zone, I get hit. There we go. Perfect. That's so shameful, though. We could do better than that. Oh, yeah, this part. Oh, wait, he's gonna electrify the water. I remember that. But also, we can just hit the boss at that phase, too. There we go. Boom. Perfect. Gets another boss taken down super easily by the almighty trip. Trip can become a dragon. That is really cool. That's even cooler than more cool than Sonic Super Ability. I just wonder what makes Trip so powerful. I don't think the game has quite explained that yet. Wait, do we get to play Act Amy as Trip? No, wait. We're playing uh, Duma. Uh, that makes sense. I know that we played Act Sonic as Trip, but. No, this is Act Amy. It, it has fruit. Yeah, this is definitely Act Amy. We just begin in the middle of it. I guess that makes sense. But what if we're at the end of it? What if this is after Amy rescues us? That'd be cool. If that's the case, wait, how are we even supposed to get the fruit? Oh, that makes sense. We're supposed to turn into spiky mode in order to get the fruit. As for you, you need to get out of here. There we go. Okay, actually collecting the fruit now is actually pretty difficult. There we go. Boom, okay. So far, no deaths. I want to keep it that way. Okay. I feel like that was a bottomless pit, honestly. That's why I was absolutely trying to jump on those enemies. Okay, knocking the fruit around is actually going to be a lot harder. Oh, I didn't even know you were an enemy. Oh no, oh no, we're underwater with zero rings. That cannot possibly be good at all. Okay, let's try to escape. Okay, luckily there's air bubble right here. There's barely any underwater. No! Ah, we died! I thought you could do the like spike jump thing underwater. But apparently if you're already falling, you can't. I wish I'd known that sooner. Uh, well, I guess I fail. That's a little disappointing, but I mean, we can still we can still uh make this a fun video. I will try the no death challenge again in the next video. But for now, let's just go for minimum death. What's the minimum amount of deaths we can get in this stage? Let's find out. I mean, in in a video is what I mean, not in this stage. So, so far we're at one death. I want to try and keep it under three for the challenge. So we can die at least two more times, but it's okay if we fail. Because we've already failed the, the hard challenge apparently, which is apparently dying. I think my issue is that I just have issues with paying attention to what I'm doing most of the time. Which is very uh, bad, especially when I'm commentating. Okay, these purple enemies are going to kill me. Okay, we're good. We almost didn't get oxygen because of them. Okay, that was just rude. That's two deaths. Can we try and take the top path, please? Yeah, I don't want to go in the water. Bad idea. That's two deaths. Okay, our minimum is three deaths. Can we actually do it? That's the real question here. Hmm. Oh, we can go right here. There's a golden fruit? Was this in the original level, Amy? Wait. Uh, this is gonna be kinda hard to uh, get. Yeah. Wait, can we spin dash it? 
Um, maybe if we do something like this? I don't understand how we're supposed to get this. There we go! Oh, that gives us a normal, awesome pear fruit thingy in jigger. Cool, I didn't realize there's actually golden fruit in this stage. That's pretty cool. We didn't find that originally as Amy. The top half is so much safer. If we want to continue and actually beat this minimum depth of 3 depths challenge, we're going to have to be uh, very observant and also avoid the bottom path at all costs. See, this path is like so much safer in every single way. I guess we can't push carts as trip apparently. Okay, don't do this. Out, 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 out. Okay, we can use the vine apparently right here. But first of all, let's actually get rid of you. Okay, let's use vine. We barely ever got to use this one because you get it so late in the game. Okay, apparently going up here. Oh, that's where the gold enemy is. I didn't expect to find them, but we did. I wonder if all the gold enemies are hiding on this map path. Out. I forget that launches you. I was expecting to do a normal jump. That's why I actually got hit right there. There we go. Oh, no, no, no. No robots. No robots allowed. Okay, apparently we can use this ability here. Why not? Okay, it doesn't work on the fruit. So why do we use it here? Oh, so we can go up here? Okay, then game. Nope. Oh, okay. Oh, we actually got one of the miners. I thought one of them didn't break. I was a little confused right there. Ooh, token! Nice! That was actually way worth it. Although these extra fruit points aren't really going to help us, are they? Okay, as for this... There's way too much fruit in our way, that's for sure. Oh, I thought we just died. No! I've got to stop falling to the bottom path. This is not good. The bottom path is a plague. Why can't I remember such a simple fact? I don't know. But all I know is this has been good. Here we go. Okay, let's actually a spin dash right here. Okay, I gotta be careful where I fall. That's my issue here. I didn't expect there to be so many bottomless pits in this game. But I get it, it's hard mode, so... Of course there's gonna be a million and one bottomless pits. Okay, that could have been a trick. I did not want to fall for it. Okay, wait for you to get unelectrified and go. Okay, and go. And go. Please don't scare me like that game. Don't give me a heart attack by doing that. Okay. Okay, this looks like the end of the stage. The original stage. Okay, that looks like a bottomless pit. I don't want anything to do with that. Yeah, this is definitely the part where Amy was carrying Trip. Okay. Good, I guess? Oh, this is making me nervous. I don't like how they added bottomless pits over here. This platforming is already hard enough. Okay, so, so far we can only die one more time. And, uh, giant boot time. Uh oh, uh oh. Please don't, don't, don't do this, don't do this. No! We failed the minimum depth challenge. Ah. Oh. Look on the bright side, if we fail the, the, uh, the one depth challenge for the other, the other, uh, the next video, that'll be okay. Okay, sorry about that, I got interrupted. Onward to the next stage. Hmm. We super duper ultra failed the last time. Wait, that feels weird. Hold on. My mm -hmm. earbuds were in the wrong, I was all like, hold on a second, I can't even hear the game properly. Yeah, I don't understand why we need to slow down time here. It doesn't seem completely necessary. Oh yeah, I forgot, Act 3 is the actual proper water stage, isn't it? That's why it's recommending us to use this ability. Which makes swimming super easy. But also, not as easy when you're being chased. 
Okay. Okay, let's just try following this real quick. Okay. Boom. Okay, that leads us up here. This leads us to a blue ring. Nice. Let's actually see what special save we're gonna get now. Because in this video, we actually managed to beat one. Oh, not this one again. I feel like it's giving us the hardest special stages on purpose. I don't know why. But it's, it just feels that way, you know? Okay, grab this. Oh, we were so close too. I didn't expect it to be that easy. Wait, was I just about to grab the coin or... No, I think I was grabbing the blue orb. Come on, I, I, I utilize these bombs perfectly to get closer. But the game apparently does not care. Apparently this coin just wants to keep on going. Oops. Come on, game. You know what would have been really cool if they made a stage that was entirely bombed? Then you'd really have to go chasing. Wait, you got to be kidding me. I launched right past the coin and it didn't let me grab it. It's supposed to let you grab it if you launch past the coin. Oh well, it doesn't matter because you got the medals either way. But I'm still slightly annoyed. Okay, there we go. Great, we lost all our rings. That was our only leverage against the enemies. Because Mr. I don't pay attention did not pay attention again. By that, I mean me. That's me. Everything is on me. Okay. And now we need to do this. Going up here is not really helpful right now. Up and up and up. You know, I can't wait till this game gets DLC. I feel like it'll, the DLC will make it so much better. Okay, apparently we need to swim somewhere. No! You should be able to swim down much faster. I was about to hit the enemy and I was trying to maneuver down, but you just can't swim down as quickly as you think you can. Not as fast as you can swim up, that's for sure. Okay, I don't like these enemies. Are these new? Or are they always in this stage? I don't know, because we breeze through the stages really quickly. But I remember. I'm pretty sure we actually went through the stages Super Sonic, if I recall correctly. No, actually, I think we unlocked Super after this stage. Jeez, what is with all this electricity? This is a little insane. Is it not? Nice top pass. We're finally outside the water. But not forever. Okay, let's see. Where does this vine need to grow? We can a shortcut. Or we can skip the shortcut and take the water slide. I'd argue the water slide is more fun than actually taking the shortcut. Nice. Oh wait, that was a burst. I mean a bullet area. Let's actually go up here. And see where, where the ledge. Are we supposed to go all the way up here? That doesn't feel right. I guess so. Very interesting. At least now we're on the top half again. How am I supposed to avoid that? Maybe I'm supposed to jump at it from below? That might be it. You know what, we just fell off the top half because I'm being reckless again. Guess we'll go down here again. How long is the stage? Yeah, actually it's not that long. I'm just a little worried, you know. There we go, now we can actually swim. And of course there'll be obstacles in our way. Look how slow you go down compared to going up. It's kind of insane. So we gotta be very careful and watch out exactly where we swim to. There we go. Cool, another blue ring. Which means another opportunity to get more medals. There we go. Perfect. Okay, so let's be careful here. Be very careful. Hmm. I wonder. Okay. 
I'm thinking, right now I'm thinking of the best strategy to actually get there. I feel like if we actually go this way, because then we'll actually head towards this dude. No, you missed it. I wasn't far enough. Okay, let's try and get this launcher at least. Get ourselves back on track a little bit right here. There we go. Boom. Ooh, this would be really good. Okay, apparently we messed it up though. Okay, let's use you. I want to use you just to get a little closer. I feel like the bombs aren't really too much of a threat. They're more for angling yourself. Because the way you attach onto them, it's not like you swing off of them, but you go directly towards them, so you can change your angle really easily with them. The Dune City Zone, Act 3. Which isn't technically Act 2, but it's Act 3 in Chip's story, that's for sure. Nice. Okay, at least we're close to 100 rings, that's good. I don't even remember the boss for this stage. What's it like again? Well, I feel like it's underwater. But I honestly don't remember. Oh, it's the, this elevator boss. I remember. This one was a pain. Because of all the water. Yeah, I remember this one. Okay, we actually need to get it to the middle in this case. Now, I thought I could actually get up there before the, the electricity launch. That's the only reason why I bothered doing it. Okay. Let's just grab this air bubble. Wait, where's the platform at? Excuse me? Am I supposed to bounce off of the drill? I'm not too sure, but... Maybe it's through that section regardless. So it doesn't really matter at this point. Okay, there's a middle platform this time. We might actually need to use this swim ability here. Yeah, I would like to cancel my ammo power. Oh, apparently that does damage. I did not know that. Cool. But right, we can actually stay at the top for a little bit. Boom. That was a good way to cheese the boss a little. I know another way to cheese this boss. Using this ability. Oh, we got hit, so it doesn't even work. Ouch. Wait, I'm pretty sure this is the final part of the boss. Okay, is it just me or the boss is getting easier? Yeah, give me my ring first. Boom. Okay, it's gotta be one more hit left. I got, I got a feeling this is the last hit, honestly. Okay, what move could we use right here? I can slow down time a little. Uh, you can bounce off of the air currents from the... Interesting. I just wanted to make it as easy as possible to get up here. And then we can finish you off with our avatar move. There we go. Boom. Take that. And hopefully you don't drown. Okay, I grabbed the air bubble, so we're good. Nice. Perfect. And we win. Anyways, that's gonna be it for this video. I'll see you in the next one. Next time, we're gonna do the minimum depth challenge, and we're gonna get zero depth. And I know it.